Hi guys, welcome back. It is Sunday and we went to Trader Joe's so I wanted to share everything that we got. A lot of new summer things and a lot of snacks. So we got pretzel bagels because I tried these before and they're really yummy. We have these which are pretzel slims. Chocolate covered pretzels it looks like. These we just tried. They're ube, I think it's pronounced ube tea cookies. Purple yam shortbread cookies. These are actually really delicious. So highly recommend those. Kinda mad I only got one box. We have the elderberry lemon balm and immune stress tea. This is new. Does that smell good? We have dark Belgian chocolate covered almonds. Those are for Scott. We have sparkling watermelon juice. Doesn't that sound so good? Oh, I completely forgot to look at the hard cider. They don't have alcohol at that one. Oh, they didn't? No. Oh, okay. Um, also, the organic sweet and spicy pineapple barbecue sauce. I feel like this is gonna be really yummy. So picked up that. Scott, this is his favorite hot sauce. So we got three of those. We have this peach walks into a bar. This is a new flavor. Interested to see how this tastes. I really like the blueberry one and then all this is frozen So we have new tangerine cream bars vanilla ice cream and tangerine orange sorbet dessert bars We have the chocolate fudge oat bars, which these have been really popular. So picked up those We have the vegan cookies and cream vanilla bean bonbons. This is coconut non-dairy I just feel like that's gonna be really yummy. Hopefully then we have buffalo style chicken poppers. I've never tried these. We have the sweet potato gnocchi, the regular gnocchi. We have black bean and cheese taquitos, mandarin, orange chicken, gotta have that. And then the last thing is this. Is this carbonara? Oh, it's like pasta, cheesy pasta. Cheesy pasta, so. That is everything we got from Trader Joe's. I also got a watermelon juice and that was really delicious too. So now I'm just gonna, did he just, did he just poop? <laughs> all right, now I'm gonna just put all this away, have some lunch, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Someone's so sleepy from the trip. He did so good, he didn't cry in the store. We don't take him anywhere, ever. Oh, what? But he cried on the way home? Yeah, yeah he cried on the way home. We had to stop in the parking lot of a random place, but. Aside from that, he didn't cry in the store, and that's like my biggest fear. We got all of these too. We got these from Bear Bells. These are really, really yummy. So we got the salty peanut, which I think this is the one that I like, and then I got two of those. Scott got a ton of the cookies and cream, but these taste like candy bars. They're really, really good. And then we also got salads, so I know, super healthy. Everything else is so unhealthy. But we got the lemony arugula basil salad kit. I believe this is new. And then we have a Caesar salad, which that looks pretty big. And then I really wanted to try this corn chowder. So, got a couple things that I forgot about. Hi guys, it is a few days later since I talked to you and showed you everything that I got from Trader Joe's. It's Thursday today and I'm literally in one of the best moods I've ever been in. I'm, I'm not gonna say anything. I'm not gonna say why I'm so excited and so happy, but oh my god, good things are coming, and I'm just I'm so freaking happy today. But anyways, I just cleaned. Oh, I thought I saw something. I just cleaned the barn. Um, and Erica's coming over. We're having a meeting for the boutique because we are launching in June, relaunching back. Um, we had a lot of like Christmas and wintry things and now it's a new season. We're having spring and summer things, graphic tees, some dresses. We're having a pop-up boutique June 27th, which is a Sunday. I will give you guys more information if you're in Massachusetts and wanna come or wanna meet me. I'm wicked shy in real life though, just so you know, I'm wicked shy. Um, so I might have to take a couple of sippy sips of something, but um, I think that will be really fun. And yeah, that's what we're doing today. Oakley is taking a nap. And I'm just having the best day ever. <laughs> I'm just having the best day. I'm gonna go out after and um, I did a Target drive up order. So I got some formula, some necessities that I needed. I, I ordered baby sunscreen, which I know babies aren't supposed to have sunscreen until they're six months old. So I'm gonna have to ask his pediatrician, but it's about to be summer. And I did just get him a sun hat, but I'm like, 
I kind of wanted to go in my aunt's pool with him to teach him to swim or just like kick his feet. I don't know, I just wanted sunscreen for him so I'm not sure what to do because the one that I ordered is not in stock anymore. So I might order on Amazon. I also have some other packages coming in the, from Amazon for the wedding. You can get a lot from Amazon, literally anything and everything. Okay, I'm gonna go because Erica is gonna be here in a few minutes and I will try and vlog the rest of my, my day with you guys and I'll talk to you in a second. I haven't showed you guys Oakley in a while, I feel. His cradle cap is still so bad. His head looks like a cantaloupe, but we've tried literally everything. But he's so cute sleeping. If I move this binky, he'd, he'd probably wake up. I also just ordered baby Q-tips because I did not know they had Q-tips for babies. So that's coming in the mail today from Amazon as well. Bless you. Look at that little smile. <laughs> Okay, so Scott ended up picking up my Target drive up order. So I'm gonna show you what I got. We also got Chipotle, so good. Okay, so I ended up getting a burrito and some queso and chips. You know, I figured if I'm working out every day, I can at least eat something yummy. Once in a while, right? Why not? I also got a big thing of toilet paper. And then I have two bags here. So I ended up getting Oakley formula because it was on sale for 10. What happened, Puff? What happened? This was $10 off, so I just got some formula for the baby. So I picked up that. I got the Ollie Collagen Gummy Rings. Reduces fine lines and boosts skin resilience. So I got these. I bet they're gonna be yummy. And I was using the collagen powder, but I haven't been making as many smoothies as I should, so I got the gummies. And then I also got Ollie Active Immunity and Elderberry. I also got iron because I got, you want a little bounce? I got a call from my doctor the other day and I am very anemic. So I have to start taking iron supplements. I should have been taking it probably like two weeks ago or even before that, I should have started it. Um, because I find myself to be tired a lot during the day and it's not because of lack of sleep because he actually He gives me a lot of sleep. I sleep seven to eight hours a night. It's a little staggered So definitely makes me a little bit more sleepy But I think it's mainly the lack of iron because I'm anemic. So I had to get these um, Then I got These Febreze light small spaces. This is in the scent sea spray says no heavy perfumes and you can just put this I guess anywhere in a small space and it's supposed to make it smell good so I think I'm gonna put one in the bedroom maybe I don't know this whole place is a small space so I could literally put one and it could be good for the entire place so I picked up that then I got soap dove men care extra fresh I always use this this is my favorite soap um, when I was pregnant, I really liked it. So I just continued to use that. And then we got the Clorox Sentiva, Sentiva, Sentiva disinfecting wipes. This is in Pacific Breeze and Coconut. So I just got a big pack of disinfecting wipes. I got another one of these Premier Protein. This is so good. The chocolate peanut butter cup, delicious. You can find it at Target. It tastes, it's definitely one of the best flavors they have. So I got that. And then of course I had to get poppies. So I got two orange, I got one raspberry rose, and then I got a strawberry lemon. So I'm probably gonna have this right now with my burrito. And we're gonna watch Family Feud and have a nice relaxing night. I cleaned up a bit. Did you just giggle? Was that a giggle? Hi Puffin! Did we go for a walk today? <laughs> we did. Teddy's getting groomed soon. Puff, you haven't been in the vlogs, right? Tell them how you feel about this baby. You still don't like him? That's all right. That's all right. <laughs> you don't have to like him, but you will love him soon. I know it. I just know it. Um, it was very humid out today, but we went for a walk. And he loves rolling in the grass. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to set Oakley up with me over there. So we can, well, so he can watch me eat. He did not want to nap this afternoon, which is fine. We're just blowing bubbles. Oakley, do you want to do the song? You want to do it too, Teddy? Okay, 
Ready? Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. And eyes and ears, mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Yay, Oakley! Woo! Oakley, can you clap your hands? Can you clap your hands? Say no, mommy. I cannot yet. All right. Okay, now let's eat. Okay, I have my burrito, queso, and chips in my um, poppy. I think they're catching on. I always put a guy's name. I put um, Scott's brother's name because I feel like they will give you a bigger burrito if it has a guy's name. Is that weird? That's like my trick. Um, although I think this is like a little bit smaller. They're never the same. They're never like a decent size, but um, yeah, that's my trick. Do a guy's name if you wanna get a little bit more food. Good morning, my battery's about to die, so I'm trying to quickly vlog, but it is Saturday. I have to bring my wedding invitations to the post office, so that's what I'm doing this morning. I went to the dermatologist yesterday, I had to get something cut out and removed from the back of my head, an unusual, abnormal looking mole, so that was scary. I'm gonna get my skin tags taken care of in a couple of weeks, so I'm excited about that and I got a couple of moles like frozen off because they were literally like peeling And off. we meet again. It's later on, my camera died mid-sentence, but I ended up going out, went to the post office, I brought my wedding invitations there, and then I went to the pharmacy. I have a prescription that's coming, I have to pick it up next week, but it's for my scars on my neck and my chest, so hopefully that works because I guess insurance doesn't cover it, so. I got a coupon and it's like 60 something dollars, but it's for a really good scar cream. So I'm gonna use it on my neck, my chest, and I'm also gonna put it on my C-section because I do have a very, very, it's a small scar, but I still have a scar. So I'm gonna use that all over and hopefully that works. I think it's called but Butetane, I don't know, something like that. Um, actually, is this it? No, I think I gave it to the guy, so I don't have it. Um, but that's what I did earlier and I got Starbucks and it was just nice to get out for a little bit because I am always home. Um, so it was nice to just like get some fresh air and like go out. Even though it was only for an hour, it was just nice. I also got a package from Pixie. Pixie has the cutest packaging. I always say that, but they really do. They came out with new blushes and you guys know I love my cream and liquid blushes. What am I hearing? Is that Amazon? Getting an Amazon package. Um, but they always have the cutest packages and they came out with cream blushes. So there's three here. You can find Pixie at Target. There's a pretty coral, which is called Juicy Floor, which is a pink, and then Ruby, which is a little bit deeper. So I'm excited to try these out. I have not tried them yet, but I'm obsessed with this little box. Okay, we're about to go to a cookout, even though it's raining. I'm just wearing a buttery yellow outfit. Oh my God, and I forgot to tell you guys that I am working with White Fox Boutique coming up and literally, I'm so excited. Is this still good? I'm so excited that I'm working with them because I've been ordering White Fox from White Fox Boutique for the past couple of months and like all of my wardrobe, I feel like the majority of it is White Fox Boutique and now to finally like work with them, I'm ecstatic. I'm very, very excited. I'm gonna have a coupon code finally, so I'll be able to tell that to you guys. But my buttery yellow outfit, which the exposure is so bright right now, but my buttery yellow outfit right now is from White Fox, and I've got a lot of clothes coming, so expect a haul soon. Am I hearing things? Sometimes I'm like, what am I hearing? My ears like ring all the time. No, I swear I hear Amazon. Okay, I gotta go. I gotta figure this out. I will talk to you guys probably tomorrow, to be honest. I'm gonna upload this on Sunday, but I'm not gonna vlog for the cookout, but I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Hi guys, happy Sunday. It is 12.30. Scott is golfing. He's been gone for like six hours, and he's golfing in the rain, so it's a little rough today. But I i am feeling super groggy, so I think it's because I haven't eaten anything except a protein shake. So I'm just gonna make the Trader Joe's Buffalo style chicken poppers. I do really like these. What I didn't like, I'll tell you what I didn't like. Oh, this is like a limited edition bar. The peach walks into a bar. Um, 
no this honestly this tastes like throw up to me oh i did not like that at all um but i do like these poppers i had them throughout the week so i'm going to make probably the rest of them maybe i'll save a couple for scott let's see one two three four five six yeah i'll probably have four and save him too we'll see well, that one's actually quite tiny. So I'm just, I'm going to make this today for lunch. Because like I said, I'm feeling out of it. And I also only had like two sips of coffee today. So I'm going to make another coffee right now. I'm going to make an espresso. So got my cup here. That doesn't look clean. It's clean, but it doesn't look clean. Let me pop these in the oven. Hey Siri, set a timer for 18 minutes. I turned on your timer alarm at 6 p.m. Wrongo. Hey Siri, set a timer for 18 minutes. What, what are we not understanding? Hey Siri, set a timer for 18 minutes. Thanks, Siri. Okay, I'm gonna make an espresso right now. I'm not talking to you anymore. I'm just gonna make the double espresso Chiaro. Ran out of my creamer and they're always sold out of that creamer. They're always sold out of that Starbucks caramel K-cups. So this is what we're working with right now. That's why I only had two sips this morning. Oh my God. And let me show you guys. This is the only creamer that I have right now. So I'm gonna use this instead, but it is not my favorite. Look at this. This is what is my favorite. I went to my aunt's yesterday and they make the best pineapple cake. My aunt and uncle make the best pineapple cake. Look at this. When I tell you this is the most moist, delicious cake, like I almost, I already hired someone for a wedding cake, which is like a naked, it's gonna be a naked style cake, but I almost want this too. I need people to experience this. So you know I'm gonna be eating that. But for now I'm gonna make the chicken poppers and an espresso. And I'll probably end up giving these to someone, I don't know, who would actually like this because I don't like it. Scott doesn't like it either. I'm doing like a little splash of vanilla syrup. I literally don't know what's, how much to do so I do the tiniest bit because I don't want it to be too gross. And then that's what it looks like. I'm just gonna add some creamer. I always add a lot of creamer. I like my coffee to look like coffee milk, basically. And I don't know why I stir it with a knife, but that's what I do every time. I'm gonna add one more cube. And we'll give this a good old try. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Okay, so I'm gonna wait for those chicken poppers to cook. I'll turn you guys around because the lighting it was absolutely terrible right there. Um, Oakley's taking his second nap of the day. We're setting up his crib today. He is too big for the bassinet. <sighs> he's just, he's such a big boy now. So we're setting up his crib, waiting for Scott to come home. I'm gonna do that. I cannot carry the crib upstairs. Um, but that is what we're doing today. I cannot wait until we have our home and I know it's coming, but I just can't wait to have like a bigger space because it is really cramped in here. So, I'm really looking forward to that. 
but I think I'm gonna end my vlog now. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I've missed talking to you guys. I'm gonna try my best to vlog as much as I can. I just, I always say the same thing, but I just don't want it to be super boring. Okay, I'm gonna talk to you guys in my next vlog. Bye.